Customers expect a seamless retail experience wherever they shop. And if necessary, a straightforward refund and exchange experience. They're comparing their air shopping experience to other industries. And while the airline ticketing process is far more complicated than say, buying a pair of shoes, customers still expect a simplified shopping and servicing experience regardless of the channel. So we're gonna go through two common examples of problems in travel retailing. The first is travel management company servicing. One thing that makes TMC so valuable is their exceptional customer service. However, if a business traveler books directly on an airline's website instead of through that TMC or online booking tool, it's very challenging and costly for that TMC to help the traveler if they need to make a change to their itinerary. In that case, the traveler either needs to work directly with the airline or they need to go call the TMC and the TMC needs to call the airline and spend considerable time and effort to make that change on the traveler's behalf. This represents a major bottleneck in corporate travel because meetings change, trips get rescheduled, business travelers often need that flexibility to make changes to their itinerary. In addition, to being difficult for business travel. This scenario also interrupts the standard uh, information flows that a corporate managed travel program relies on, like duty of care and corporate reporting. Business travelers are often high value, loyal, frequent travelers. So airlines, TMCs, and travel managers all wanna make sure that their experience is great and that they're well taken care of. To ensure these travelers receive the service that they need, TMCs and travel managers need better access and transparency to their traveler's data, as well as the ability to act on it. So take for instance a business traveler and he's booked a pretty complex itinerary through the travel agent. And then, you know, he's starting in one city, he's going to a new city, he's going, then he's going to a third and a fourth city before coming back home. Now on that first leg of his trip, maybe there's a snowstorm and he needs to move it and so he's at the airport he goes directly to the agent and he asks the agent hey i need to change this first leg of my itinerary now that whole trip was booked in the agency so the agent at the airline is able to actually change it but does that information then flow back to the agent to actually know where that traveler is and what flight it is he's on um and then if the traveler wants to make a change on the next second, third, fourth leg of his itinerary, has the agent now been boxed out? Is the agent even able to make that change or is that whole itinerary now owned by the airline? So in an omni-channel servicing environment, you'd wanna be able to have the, the customer book in one channel, service in another channel, and then be able to pick that booking back up and service in a third channel uh, for the rest of the trip. So when we talk about unused values, this really refers to any outstanding value um, the traveler has with the airline. So that in could include a voucher that I've received, um, a ticket, ticket refunds, refunds of the ancillaries uh, that we've been talking about, uh, you know, kind of any kind of boarding compensation. So you could kind of think of it as the equivalent of a store credit with the airline. Actually using that value can be complicated sometimes, especially when those values exist in multiple channels. So for example, I may have purchased a ticket directly with the airline, uh, but had to cancel. And rebooking that trip, I would like to use a travel agency or TMC. But in today's retailing environment, I'm not able to do that. I'm not able to take the value that I have directly with the airline and move it over to the travel agency. The travel industry really needs a better way to allow the traveler to take those unused values and use them again, no matter which channel uh, they want to book in. Today, again, just not the case. It's not very user friendly.
the industry also needs a better way to understand that outstanding value available to the traveler, as well as an easy way for me as the traveler to apply that value to future purchases. So related to these two key challenges of managing unused value, as well as expanding TMC servicing, ARC is working very closely with airlines, travel agencies, TMCs, and travel managers to address those common challenges, which can greatly improve the customer experience.